we've all seen the crazy long lines at food banks across the USA. But now we're also seeing this. Desperate people apparently struggling to feed their families, shoplifting for staples like bread, eggs, and milk. These are people who you would not think would shoplift. Um, they probably never shoplifted before. We can catch 10 to 20 people a day, and think about the ones we don't catch, it might be three or four times that amount. 54 million Americans are going hungry every day, up 45% from last year. In New York City, corner convenience stores, also known as bodegas, are stocked with essential items people need in their daily lives. At the beginning of the pandemic, they were lifelines for hard-hit communities. But as the months wore on, these mom-and-pop stores became, more than ever before, targets for shoplifters. In this particular bodega, we have had shoplifting go through the roof. It's a disaster right now. Fernando Mateo represents bodega owners. People rob blatantly. They know there are cameras everywhere, yet they still take the risk. It's up maybe two, 300% in some bodegas. Mateo says while he feels some sympathy for shoplifters trying to feed their families, many of the thieves are just that, thieves. Bodega owners are poor people as well. You know, you're not robbing from the rich, you're robbing from the poor. The organization No Kid Hungry is working to provide for those children who are experiencing food insecurity. And if you'd like to help them, we've got a link for you over at InsideEdition.com.